We're going to play some more Amsoft games. Right, we're going to start with Electro Freddy. So, let's get my controller. Pressing the key to continue. Let's continue. That's me, Freddy, running back on... Oh! Side to side there. I've got to go and put stuff there. Little blip blops. I've got to clear all these electronic things, products, while being attacked by El Beardo there. Chucking what looks like um, Spectrums, at, uh, Sinclair's at me. Which is bizarre things. Oh, I nearly got it in the head by that computer, which I think's a Commodore. Done. I can get a key. I'm out of here. Level two. Here we come. There we go. Then I suppose these are tellies. I don't know. TVs. I like the sound effects. Silly. I'm gonna push that one out from behind there. Get out of here. Stop chucking computers at me. No. Oh. Luckily, they've got an ambulance. The works ambulance. Oh. Bee-boo, bee-boo, bee-boo. What's down there? Can I go? No, I can't go down there. Let's have a look down there. Yeah, just come and get me. I'm not doing anything. I'm just walking around. Do-do-do-do-do. 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 Run back up here. Get that. Oh, boom. Uh, ha! Got ya! Get marks for that. And down there. So it's pretty much... That's Electro Freddy, really, I suppose. Gets fit. Oh. I can't even get for level two. Type in your name. That's my name now. Here we go. Oh, look at that. Beep. It's a... It's basically based on an actual battle. Right, this is Graf Spear, where we take a uh, a ship and try to blow up the ally ships, basically. So, we'll start. Okay. Your supplies have been replenished, and some replays your score so far is zero. Good. Right, so, we're between South America and Africa. Oh, wait a minute. Right, I've got to go down. You see them blips that keep appearing? They're the uh, submarines I've got to find. And when you're near a blip... Process. Not now, S. There we go, you see, I'm near it. So I've got to turn. No. I'll turn around until I can find it. I'm being shot at now. Where are you? I can't find it. South, no, north, no. There I am. Oh. Teeth torpedo, strike torpedo. Ah, oh, oh, it's too far away. I got really quite good at this once upon a time. I'm going to blow up in a minute. I'm about to die. I press M to scuttle. You can scuttle the ship. Okay, so, anyway, that was Graf Spear. I'm going to play Roland on the Run. I never had this. But you know, the Roland games. <clears throat> Very much popular on the Amstrad, obviously, because Roland was the nickname for the Amstrad. Okay. Oh, yes. 
It's like a cross between Frogger and Frogger. Accelerate the train, decelerate the train. Jump from the first train to the first line of traffic. ZX and C. Okay. Enter number of lives. I'm optimistic. Do you mean one to two five five? Two, five, five, five doesn't work on here. Two, four, four then. One. So that's me in the back, the flashy boy in the back there. And I've got to try and jump onto the, for some reason. So. Lots of beeping going on, and I don't really know what's going on. I'm sure somebody will be going, you should be doing this, you should be doing that, but good grief, look at the stare of that. I mean, scrolling was never the Amstrad's strong point, but that's too bad at slow speeds. You know, you've got some sort of scrolling going on. A bit faster than that, it starts to go a bit choppy, and then it's like, my eyes. I don't want to play that anymore. How dare you. Um... Let's try Roland Goals Digging. I didn't have that one either. I had ropes and caves. Are you using a green screen? No, I'm not. Please wait, okay. Seriously, come on. Well, that took about a year. Well, that's nice. Roland Goes Digging by Chris Hunt. Instructions gone. Oh, God. That's the important bit. The background music may be turned off by using the Enter key. Oh, joystick. Right, I can't do that. Joystick, of course. Oh, God, he's pissed off, isn't he? I mean, did they have to fall down really far? I mean, you might have said in the instructions, but I didn't bloody read them properly. I can't dig that bit. Get off! I've got an apple alien on my head. I ain't no William Tell. I'm standing here. Come and get me, come and get me, come and get me. Come and get me. You rubbish aliens, you lot. I just realised I've just boxed myself in there, haven't I? Wow. Mummy. Tag teams. Well. That was a game. Yay, it's Oh Mummy! I like Oh Mummy. That's nice, quite a good um, conversion, this. I mean, it's good music, but after 20 minutes, you want to go... Uh, yes, we'll keep the sound effects on. Right. And as you can see, they, they've actually done... All right with the graphics. Compared to, say, the Spectrum, where it was very... They just used, like, the character set. They've actually put some thought into this. And they've made the treasure look like, like Egyptian-type treasure. Instead of just pound signs. Ah, mummy's after me. Brrr, mummy. And, yep, yeah, so it's like anything. Oh, I've opened a tomb with another mummy in it. No! But I'm looking for a key and a 
scroll. Right, there's a scroll. Kill a mummy using a scroll. Ah. I can do that. Kill the mummy because I had the scroll. I got the tomb. And I need the key now to get out. There it is. So then... And I've got all that. So I can get out and then into the next one. And that's it. It just goes on and on. Like that. So I've got a scroll so I can kill a mummy. That one's having a dancing corner. Come down. They're quite cute, really, these mummies on this. Here he's on then. No, I've uncovered another tomb with another mummy in it. Brilliant. Get away. Ah, kill you. Oh, where's the key? Oh, that's one of my men's dead. Means I'm my last man. Oh, it will be in that corner. And then we can go out. So then there should be one follow me and another one in the team. So that's two mummies now. In the dig site, sorry. Oh, come on. <laughs> Get away from me, mummy. Whoa. Right, I just need the tomb. There it is, I can get out now to the next one, but I'll have four mummies now. Oh no, it's mummy apocalypse. Oh, there we go, that's nice. Isn't it? Actually, I'm going to see if I can find a scroll because I don't want all these following me into the next one. Oh, bottoms. There it is. Take you out. Oh my goodness me, look at all these mummies. And I've uncovered another one. It's a very cursed place where I am. Oh. Another man's gone. Oh, and another one. I'm running out of workers. Oh, there's a big one to the pay rise at this rate. Oh, craps. There's a scroll. I can take one of the mummies out. I suppose you can sacrifice some men for mummies. Is it worth it in the end? Is a human's life worth a mummy's life? I don't think so. I don't think so. If you're having trouble with mummies at work, go and see your union rep. Oh, anyway, so yeah, so mummy on that. I'll quite like that. Pajama Rama. Pajama Rama. Never had this. Don't really know much about it. I just have it on the emulator. That's quite loud. Featuring Wally Week. Oh, okay. So, what have I got there? A radio... A door handle. Wally... Wally? All right, so it's, I guess it's a, uh, a collecting bucket is empty. Wally's dead. Wally's floating up. I don't know, gravity goes weird. Wally. Hello, I'm a kid in 1984 and I'm just giving this to play. Save me. I used to like this game, but it used to take ages to load on cassette. It was literally ten, ne nearly 10 minutes to load, which, you know, you think, oh, 10 minutes isn't long. But when you're 8 and you want to play a computer game, 10 minutes is a long, long time. Even now it's taken a while and it's on an emulator. But yeah, I like, quite like this. Um, Let's change the colour of the background. Something that's not going to blind me. All right, I'll do. So we all know the thing. It moves around. You've got to collect these. It's randomised if you don't get out of the way of the... Or touch the sides. You go splat, basically. So 
But yeah, so you spend like 10 minutes for this to load. It never really got played much. Scrolling is very jerky. You know, the, we, I mean, we played the uh, Roland game earlier where the scrolling was less jerky. Ooh. Oh, you see then? It spun back round again. Cheeky. Ooh. Let's put them back in there now. Ooh, yummy. Look at them bits I can eat. Yum, yum, yum. Oh, I did it. Hooray! It's on to the next level. Ah! Ooh, that was lucky then. What are them? Look like little uh, plums or something. Little plum. <laughs> it's a reference there for anyone. Oh, splat. Yeah, I always liked this game. thought it was pretty good. Just took ages to load. I had better things to do, so I used to play, play on Mummy. Oh, well. Zob the Great, Dax von Dracula. Squeaky Sue. Now I'll finish up with playing Classic Fruit Machine. The only problem with this is it flashes a lot, especially when you get a, um, if you get the jackpot. I mean, them bits are all right. But if you get the jackpot, it really does flash, so I'll blank that out for anybody who's uh, sensitive to that sort of thing. So let's play a bit of Fruit Machine. Ooh. On the original cassette, you had a list of what all the uh, the reels were, so you could actually sort of basically cheat and win. Um, nudge. Always nudge. Always nudge. Up on that one. Down on that one. Down on that one. Now I can gamble this. I might actually win the jackpot. Should we gamble? Yes. I got a quid back. Wait. I go for winner spinners because I, I like these as well. Get yeah, like good noises. Five gamble. Only three. It does a little spin underneath. Seventy p. Ooh, then another thirty p on that. Another thirty p. So one pound thirty. Um, I'm gonna win a spinner. I get. Reckon I can get more than 70p. No, I just collect them. I was wrong. But well, that's gambling. Gamble. It held it, it'll do it again. And it's got three, so I've got 30p. Collect. 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 Oh, okay. Well, it's got me on the scoreboard. Ooh. Try gambling it. It went up. And then it went down again. Got three lemons. Yes, they're lemons. I know they're a bit rhomboidal. <laughs> oh, gripes. Got two nudge on that. I've got ten nudges. Um, right, see if we can find the sevens. Nope. Nope. Got to be careful here. It's another bar. No. I'm a last 10p. I'm soft hall of fame. Because that's gambling. It's a mugs game. Right, well... That's Amsoft for you. More Amsoft games. Brilliant. Wasn't it?